Hello everyone, welcome to yet another exciting episode of Rewild. We are back in the Sava Valley Conservancy, but this time we are having some rhino notching operations. I hope you know what that is. If not, stay tuned to learn more about the part of the world that we have for you today. air notch every year so that we can essentially ID the rhinos. So each animal has its own individual unique number and then when the scouts are in the field they will take pictures and from the notches and the holes that we make we can um, tell who it is which is really important. It's been a very good uh, thing to do and we're very grateful that we've got people that support us in this work. the process we do it once a year um, with the calves it, with the calves that were born typically two years ago because then they're, they're sort of the right age the late Helen Jones Fairney who was a celebrated veterinarian she was a member of our committee she was the first lady president of the Australian Veterinary Association she sadly passed away three weeks ago and we've named this rhino in her honour and the legacy fund has been set up and I hope that this piece will go on there and will show that this is what it's all about. She had a great passion for the rhino. She set up a fund for veterinary aid in Zimbabwe here and she was one of the most distinguished veterinarians and we hope that young Helen here will lead an equally distinguished and happy and successful life. Good luck, Helen. Um, it's important because you, A, you need to be able to identify your animals so that you can count them properly. Otherwise, if you've got rhino with no identification features, no notches, um, you're at risk of double counting animals. So counting more than you actually have. Um, and then it's important to uh, keep a record of who's who, um, family relationships. quite a stressful environment when we're actually doing the rhino but you know we we all get on really well and yeah it's just good fun um, and I, obviously seeing a rhino that are that up close is, is also really cool. For the Savi I suppose it's the, run, the rhino are fairly vulnerable in that um, we've got some areas that aren't fenced so the anti-poaching guys have a really tough job on their hands. Extraordinary how we have people who have dedicated their lives into understanding these rhinos better, knowing their movement, knowing their every location, every time. Just like us human beings, these rhinos have names and they also have ID numbers. So stay tuned for more episodes of Rewild, join the movement, learn more, understand the animals better, save the world to save the world. Remember to subscribe, share, like, comment, tell a friend to tell a friend. I'll see you next time with more interesting episodes of Free World. My name is Terio Gondo, your host, and I'm glad I could have you on this episode. I look forward to seeing you next time. Ciao.